I will show you how to create an account and list your tuitions on Centorino.com using your mobile phone. Open any browser like Google Chrome, and from the address bar or the search box, type Centorino.com. When the website opens, click on the menu icon. Scroll down, and you will find a register, click on it. Now, you need to fill in your username, your name, email address, and choose a password for your account. Then, click on Register. Next, go through all the items on this menu one by one. Right now, we are at Update Profile. Select an image for your profile and click on Done. Scroll down. Here, you need to provide your phone number, including your country code. The format should be, plus sign, country code, then your number without any spacing or dashes. Click on Save. We have updated our profile, the next step is to go to Cover Image. Select an image and click on Done. You can choose, full width, or boxed as you wish, then click on Save Changes. Now, we will go to Teaching Methods. First, write the languages you can speak, separate them with commas if there's more than one. Then, provide your WhatsApp number, including the country code. Plus sign, country code, and then your number. Next, there are three questions. 1. Would you teach online? If yes, write yes, if no, leave it empty. 2. Would you teach at the student's place? If yes, type yes, if no, leave it empty. 3. Would you teach at your place? If you would teach at your place, write yes, if no, leave it empty. I will teach at my place, so I will write yes. Then click Save Changes. Now we go to the dashboard. In the dashboard, we have two menus, one on the right and one on the left. The right menu has View Profile, Update Profile, Change Password, and Logout. On the left menu, we have everything we need. First, we need to add tuition, but since we are creating an account for the first time, it will ask us to choose a plan. Click Add Tuition. And then click on the button to choose a plan. There's a free plan and a paid plan. I will choose the free plan. Now, it is asking me to complete my account details, such as name, a brief description about myself, and my experience. Then select your country, city, and write your full address. Scroll down and click on Save Changes. The changes have been saved. From here, you can see your membership plan details. I can post two ads for a period of 365 days, so no need to renew your plan, as it is already valid. This step needs to be done only once when you create your profile. Now, we go to the top left menu and click on Add Tuitions again. The first thing we do is browse for an image for our listing. As you see, it is still processing, so I have to wait until it shows completely. Now, scroll down and select the category, then select a subcategory. I put a title and some description about what I will teach. Scroll down, here is the SEO title. This is how your listing will show in Google search results. You can use the same title you used above. Also, write a short description and provide a couple of keywords. On the next page, you will be asked to write how much you will be charging per class, as well as the currency in which you will be charging. Then click on Submit. Scroll down to see your listing. 
you can edit and delete from here, and also view your listing from here. This is my listing. This is what I am charging. My address. My WhatsApp number. What I am going to teach. This is my account ID here, if I click it, it will view my profile as seen by visitors. This is my top banner, and this is my personal image. I can put my own photo here in place of this. And here are my details. This is my first listing. Now, what should I do? I should go and share my listing with all my friends, from these buttons here. And finally happy teaching.